going live. I wonder if anybody can see or hear this. So, this is my first time going live. I'm trying to figure out various different settings. I'm hoping that the sound and the video is okay. I'm certainly not doing this in 4K. Oh, hi there, Largemouth Bass Studios, Lane Fraley, and then a bunch of other people. Nice. Okay, hello to both of you. Sam. All right, sound is good. That's good. Fox, oh, you guys are all... <laughs> and, and girls, if there's any girls in there that will... Uh, pop on soon enough. This is my first time doing anything live. Wonderful. So last night I picked up this Hoover Air steer Steerable and I was just walking around uh, my subdivision and here it was sitting there. So hi Thomas. I have not done anything with it. This is what it is. As you can see, I plan to, if it's possible, do something with the suction, airflow, and power. And don't you love this, this great tape job right here? I think they used a, a huge part of a roll of tape. And <laughs> you got to see the, you got to see the brush roll here. Oh, let's see. There, isn't that, isn't that great? You know what, let me get you closer. I'm working with a, a tripod here, so I'm going to be extending and retracting the legs probably quite a bit. Let's see if I can hold this up. There you go. What do you think of that? <laughs> so I think this is a case of, and I see a lot of this, use it until it just doesn't work anymore. Isn't that cool? I think, I think a lot of people have, have that attitude. And, oh yeah, let's see, here's, there's the ratings plate. Appears to be made 2015. Manufacturer code J15A. So I'm guessing that means 2015. So normally I was just going to make a video of this like I normally would. I said, you know what? Why don't I try this live thing? I don't know if anybody would like the live thing, but you know, whatever. Uh, let's see. Well, I guess we got to take the cord off, right? Get this out of the way. See, is that on? All right, I'm going to guess this is off. And let me back you up a little bit so you can see a little more. Okay. So, let's see. All right, we have power. That wasn't on. I haven't examined the system to see if there's any major clogs or anything, so let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. Well, it turns on. Now, there's a button right here that says brush roll on and off. So, let's see. I think you just put this down like that. Make sure you can still see everything. All right, here we go. Uh, all right, that's spinning. OK, 
Okay, so I'm hearing the airflow relief valve go. So there's something in there that's clogged. Uh, gee, what a surprise. I mean, normally I get these things and, and they're clogged, of course. So let's see what I got here. So it looks like we have a working machine, at least partly. See, what is what does this look like? Oh, I've seen worse than that. Still might be clogged, but I've seen a lot worse than that. You know, I don't think that there's I don't think there's a whole lot that's clogging this. Well, you got some right there, don't you? Look at that. And this. I you know, I can see through it though. I can. I can I can see through it. Okay, we're getting there. And of course showed you this. Um, I can't... Well, this normally I think would... I think this would normally come off right here. I don't know if I should try to take it off. Oh, okay, we have... Look at that. We have two different kinds of tape. See that? We have the blue tape and the black tape. Isn't that nice? Let's see. Does this come off easy? Oh, it's supposed to twist off? I mean, I don't want to break it, so I'll have to. I'll have to look into that. <laughs> I assume that's supposed to come off fairly easy, but uh, it's not at the moment. This comes off here. I think there's some stuff in there. Oh yeah, yep. There's there's stuff in here. There is a clog in here. Let's see. I don't know. Ah, you probably can't see that that well. But yes, there is a clog in here. I'll get some of that with my finger. Oh, jeez. Yeah, there, we definitely have a clog in here. And oh, dog food. Or maybe it's cat food. There, some stuff came out. Oh, there's more. There's more. Oh yeah, it's still coming out. I should have brought another vacuum out here with me. <laughs> I didn't know if this thing was even going to turn on. We'll add that to the pile. There is something else in here, though. And I apologize for taking so long to get that out. I should probably have, like, a screwdriver. Well, we are building a nice little pile of pet food. These little brown things right here. That's funny. <laughs> yeah, so this is this is part of the problem, I imagine. Look at that. It's just, <laughs> it's just coming out. Okay. I wish it was an easy way to separate this. It's like, ah. It's still coming out. Ooh, I don't know what that is. That's metal. There you go. That's a metal piece. Ah, more clog. There we go. Look at that. So you guys and girls, whatever, are watching somebody live declog a machine. That's funny. Uh, I think I might put everything back together. And see what happens now.
Yeah, we don't uh, we don't bother to clean these things. We just use them until they don't work anymore. That's always nice. All right, let's see what happens now. And let me um let me adjust the camera a bit. Sorry, I'm not looking at the comments. Trying to figure out if we can declog this thing or not. All right, let's see what happens now. No, nope, there is. I'm not really detecting much here. Aha! Look at all that. Giant log just came out live. <laughs> it's filling the bin. Look at that. Here, we'll add it to the pile. Let's see, can you still see the pile? that to the pile. Cool. Here's the clog pile. There's more of the, more of the clog pile. Isn't that neat? This looks like part of a strap. It's not bad. More clog pile. if you have anything from the hose end. Hey. <laughs> well, it's squeaky, but uh, yes, we have airflow. And let me get my, my Baird meter here. All right, let, let's see what it does. See, make you make sure you can see that. All right, here we go. All right, so it's got a little bit. It's not much. A little less than a one. But we didn't have anything before. How about a quickie suction test? It feels like it still has a lot of suction. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> That's going to pull that right over, isn't it? Yeah, let me. Oh. Move that. I certainly don't want it to fall over. I think we figured out the reason why the people decided to get rid of it after five years, and that's because they clogged it. That's, well, typical, I guess. Let's see, what's this? Ooh, here I can separate these two pieces. I wonder, though, if I can suck up some of this stuff. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to cheat. So I'm going to take this, right, and I'm going to put, I'll put the ridiculous stuff in here <laughs> by hand. Here, here's how you fill your vacuum. <laughs> nah, there, there's that. Right. There's that. And this weird metal piece. I'll put that in there. I, the rest, I think we're probably safe to actually vacuum up, um, I hope. Let's see, you can see all that. All right, here we go.
So I think uh, this unit is probably savable. Look at that giant blob. That is a big blob of hair in it. I bet you this will come out kind of nice. Well, except for the terrible tape job. Okay, so you uh, lucky few, let's see, you lucky 20 people that decided to follow me live, you get to see what's happening first. So, thanks so much for, I guess, watching the um, very first live VAC Lab stream. And I hope that the sound and the picture was uh, acceptable. I have no idea what it was like, but uh, based on a couple of comments, seemed to be okay, I suppose. So stay tuned for more videos of this. And uh, let's see, was it Fit It's, Fit it's Fun? That was fun. I'll look forward to <laughs> videos of it. I hope it was fun. Just decided to try this out. Okay, thanks for watching, and I'll have to figure out how to actually turn this off. Let's see, which button does that?